Hey Gemini, so as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be the March 2023 reading for our Geminis, okay? So Gemini Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, Mars, or North Node, it really doesn't matter, love. If you in any way at all identify as a Gemini, then this reading is for you, okay? Okay. Let us see, Gemini, what are the messages? Thank you, Spirit. What are the messages for Gemini for the month of March 2023? Okay, trying to follow your heart. Okay, when it comes to whether or not you should walk away from something or someone, whether or not you should deal with something or someone. Okay, possibly all things. Just going through the checklist. Should I deal with this person or not? You know, uh, because it's affecting you or affecting your heart at this point. All right, so let us see. What do we have for our Geminis? Thank you, Spirit. Okay, we have the third chakra here. Okay, so talking about your solar plexus, your vitality, your health, your energy. Okay, so do you have the energy for something or not? You have deceit here. Okay, you feel like someone continues to try to deceive you or someone continues to try to get over on you. And at this point, you just cannot allow for it to affect your energy anymore. Okay, so let us see. For our Geminis, yep, we have envy. Okay, so like I said, this person, whatever their real intentions are, have been shown to you several times, whether it's deceit, whether it's envy, doesn't matter. All right, I feel like it's continually shown to you here. And at this point, you're just over it. Okay, that's the energy that I feel. Let's get more for our Geminis. We have cornucopia here reverse. So basically what the person was aiming to do was to stop something that belongs to you or to stop the fruitfulness that you will receive from your labors. Like, I don't really see how that's going to work though, because you did the labor. So let us see for our Geminis. We have door to romance in reverse. So someone, okay, they could have been faking love here with door to romance in reverse. And we have rest and rejuvenation in reverse. Okay. So your peace is disturbed. You're not allow you're not allowing it to affect you to the point of disturbing your health for real, for real, because the third chakra is still in the upright position. Nevertheless, sometimes you might feel tired because rest and rejuvenation is in reverse. So that's what the person is working on your energy to try to stop things from progressing as far as you being successful. Or you receiving love, okay? Underline the energy here, attachment. Yeah, so somebody has an attachment to seeing you fail or seeing you down or seeing you out or seeing you in a position of uh, being weak, okay? That's what I'm seeing here. Let us dig a little bit. Mm-hmm. Someone is trying to stop you from getting the fulfillment of wishes that you have, okay, or that you desire. You want certain things to come into fruition? Well... They want them to not because it's you. They don't want you to have them. Okay. They don't want you to have happiness. They don't want you to have love. They don't want you to have success. Or they don't want you to feel successful. They don't want you to feel loved. Okay. You might still have these things in your life because what's for you, Spirit is going to make sure you get. But they want to make sure you don't feel like you have them. They want to make sure you feel weak powerless without okay so let us see here somebody's doing spell work we have partnerships and alliances in reverse so a fake friend okay trying to keep you trapped trying to keep you stuck here in some way could like literally just be because you pulled away from this person with emotional attachment here and they want to i mean emotional withdrawal and they have emotional attachment they are stuck on you you get what i'm saying and they don't want you to move forward they don't want you to move on Okay, it's giving weird vibes. Okay. We have material and spiritual prosperity. See what I'm saying? They don't want you to receive your universal gifts and blessings, but how does that sound? Are they the universe? So we have mental conflict here in reverse. I don't think you're confused about who this is. I think you know exactly who this person is or where it's coming from. Because like I said, you walked away from them. Emotional withdrawal was here. You don't deal with this person like that anymore. Okay. So let us see. We have positive movement forward. Yeah, you already moved away from dealing with this individual. So you already know who it is, all right? Ace of Wands here, passion ignited. 
you somehow overcame everything that they threw at you. Your foundation is still solid, still secure. So here they come back with some more. Okay. <laughs> here they come back with some more. All right. Let us see. Fire Gemini's. Lord have mercy. Um, still have love. So you see what I'm saying? The things that they tried to stop you from getting, you're still getting. All right. Three of Swords, Energy in Reverse. They're just still attached emotionally. You emotionally withdrew. They're still emotionally attached. That's what I said. All right. You're not confused. You know exactly who this is with the judgment card here. Truth. Okay. Let us get a little bit more. Mm hmm. Like I said, foundation is still firm, still intact. Okay. Everything's still secure and in order. The will of fortune. You're still progressing, still moving forward. All right. So this person is like, damn, how did that happen? You know, I, here I did this spell and I did this ritual and I did this and I did that. And they're still progressing. Yeah, two of wands, movement, choices, decisions. They still have options. <laughs> like, this is wow. You get what I'm saying? How? That's what they like, seven of cups in reverse. But it's like, don't be confused. You know that you're envious. You know that you do deceptive things. The things that you do because they're done from deception and envy, that's why they're not working. All right? So this is why you're not getting the things that you want, whoever this envious person is. Okay? Because they're... <sighs> Wow. Somebody was trying to interfere with uh, someone's divine counterpart situation as well. You get what I'm saying? Like I said with that daughter romance, this person was trying to mess with your energy, which in tune would have messed with your finances, your relationship, all of your connections, everything. Okay. Wow. So all of this because of deception and because of envy. Like I said, we saw deceit earlier and, and we see envy and here's deception and envy. So like I said, it's both. It's both of them, okay? So let us see here. Lord have mercy. All right. For some of you, if not a friend, could be a family member. We have Justice, a karmic family member. Um, yeah, this person has betrayed you several times, multiple times, 10 times over, okay? But Spirit is saying everything is being balanced here. The scales are being balanced. They're being tipped in your favor because you did nothing wrong. All right, let us see here. We have the Three of Cups energy once again in reverse. Somebody is, like I said, if this is not a sibling or someone who's close to you like that in regards to family, a friend, okay, that you've ended the friendship with, you've disconnected from this person because of their ways, okay? We have the Hanged One in reverse. See, you freed yourself. You ended the situation in very abruptly, like I said, okay? We have the Four of Wands. You're still stable. You're still secure. Your home is still intact. And we have the death card, okay? The transformation change coming in here because you freed yourself once again from this low vibrational energy. And for some of you, yes, a sibling. For others of you, simply a karmic friendship, okay? But with the Empress in reverse, this is someone who is not loving, is not caring, is not nurturing. You know, an Empress is supposed to be someone who's, you know, a mother figure, or an older woman, you know what I'm saying? One of the matriarchs, if not the matriarch in the family, okay? Um, Empress is also just some a divine feminine energy who carries themselves a certain type of way, all right? So this person is the complete opposite. This is a karmic feminine that we're discussing here with the Empress in reverse, okay? Not loving, not nurturing at all, okay? We have the chariot here in the upright. So you, you guys are just progressing. You're moving forward. Spirit is confirming that that's the right thing to do. Um, this person has gone through a lot and they try to, you know, play victim with everyone. But I feel like because of the seven of swords in reverse, this person creates the situations that they are in or that they go through. And then they try to play victim and make everybody else feel bad, make them feel guilty. And it, it no, it doesn't work like that. All right. So let's see what else here. Yeah, we have the queen of cups in reverse. This is a very non-loving person. Like I said, not nurturing at all. All right. We have the ace of cups. So just know they're going to come in excuse me, they're going to make an offer to you, all right, 
but it's not going to be a genuine offer. It's not going to be a genuine or sincere type of situation. It's just coming back in with more deceit, which is why Spirit says choose wisely. Meanwhile, the card is in reverse, which is the Seven of Cups energy. So you're definitely going to choose wisely. You're not confused. You know what it is that you need to do to, to free yourself from this person. All right. So let us see here. Queen of Cups. <laughs> Yeah, the truth has already been revealed to you, and spirit is already stepping in on your behalf. So, that's it on that note. You get what I'm saying? I guess it just is what it is. Ten of Swords, that's the end of that. You know, it's a wrap, folks. Right? So let us see for our Geminis. Ooh, what do we have? We have growth. I want to expand my consciousness and my awareness. So, now that you know better, you do better. All right. You have peace in your life. You just want peace. You don't want your peace disturbed. Like I said, that's what they will do or that's their plan or that's what they have done all the time. You already know that. So when they come back in with this BS, no, we cannot allow that anymore. All right. It says I am a being of love and I released all negative energy. All. OK, not some, not most, not here and there. All of it. Okay, so this was your message or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and hair grease.